the water from down there will soon be flowing up here. Hey y'all, welcome back to Strand Farm where we grow independent together. Today, I want to give a brief update on the ram pump pond. I did a little bit of work on it during my wedding anniversary and then I took a break and then we got a huge monsoon rain. It's down here. Huge monsoon rain for like 15 minutes. It was really coming down and then it rained for a good portion of the whole day. And that kind of opened up some of the streams and made them more permanent. And I want to show you guys how much flow we have going into our ram pump pond this morning. Moosey, come on. It's so beautiful. Right here. All right, this is the above view. As you can see, the pond is filling up the flow that is coming from the chill zone. And then up the mountain this way. The goal down here is to get a three gallon per minute flow. If I can get three gallons per minute coming out of this pond, then I have enough flow to set up the tiny version of the land to house ram pump that I have just been so excited to get going. So excited in fact that it's taken me three years to set it up. Here's my water. Coming down this little log. What do you think guys? Is there three minute? Is there three gallons per minute coming out of this pond? I have a simple way of trying to figure it out. Moose! Come on down here. Moose, come on! Moose is about mm, 20 feet up from me. Down here. I need the water to go from this pond up the mountain. It's starting to snow. Real neat feature to this stream is that I can titrate the flow to exactly what's needed by my ram pump. Oh, the snow is beautiful. What you see here is a diversion. I can change the amount of water that goes down to the ram pump pond by moving this rock. Are you ready? Do you hear that flow? I can see it changing on its way down. Look at this current, it's faster. <laughs> so if I wanted to set up a ram pump that was a little bit larger, I could probably do that too. But I want to titrate it to be just enough to get water into the ram pump. Well, that's my update for today. Thanks for tuning in. Next time, I'm going to drill the hole 
for the ram pump and I'm gonna put that half inch PVC pipe into my pond and see if the pond can maintain its volume while it's outflowing. See you next time. water from down there will soon be flowing up here.